Ladies and gentlemen, my first guest tonight has starred in such hits as Sex, Lies, and Videotape, Green Card, and Groundhog Day. Her newest picture, Multiplicity, is currently in theaters everywhere. Let's take a look. I love my job, and so far I'm doing great at it. In fact, Valerie said if I keep it up, she's going to move me into a state, so very soon I could be making a very good living. Now, now I know this is hard for you, and I can imagine the kind of day that you've had, but I am not quitting. So we are just going to have to work all this out, and that is it. Man, confrontational. Give me the heebie-jeebies. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Andy McDowell. Thanks. You look beautiful. That's thank an incredible you. dress. Oh, thanks. Very nice. You know, I gotta say, uh, I heard today, the segment producer tells me, Annie McDowell's gonna bring you a present today. She's gonna bring you a present. I know. And then he just ran up here just before and said, ah, she didn't bring anything. I forgot. It's not my fault. You, the, you wanna know the truth? I'm crushed, yeah. I'm really sorry. My assistant's got a hangover. <laughs> oh, really? Okay. <laughs> it's good to get a lot of drunks working for you. <laughs> it's a good system. Well, what were you going to bring me? What was it? Was some, it some chai. I was going to bring you some chai. What it's is a, chai? It's a, it's a kind of tea that I just love. It's this great stuff. It gives you really nice. I can't drink coffee because it makes me shake. Mm -hmm. But I like chai. So you I was like going to bring chai? you some chai. It yeah. gives you a really good what? <laughs> just a little, you know, it's like... Puts a, you in a really good place. Man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, and it's legal, right? And it's legal, <laughs> okay, yeah. Okay, good. It's just it's a tea. It's oh, a it's tea. a tea. It's a tea, yeah. Okay. Drink a lot of this stuff? Well, I have to be careful. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why? Because it's really, I don't know, I'm very sensitive. My body, my system is really sensitive, so mm -hmm. it really gives me... An... It, gets you, it gets you going, Yeah, yeah, yeah. Everyone likes some chai. Right, some there. chai. I mean, yeah, my, my niece loves to come stay with me. We drink chai and go shopping. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, we shake. And chai makes you kind of, wait a minute, what? You shake, you get all excited. You drink this stuff called chai, you start <laughs> shaking, then you run out to a mall? <laughs> <laughs> It's a little odd. Kind of. Really? And don't people start talking when they see Annie McDowell like walking around the aisle, say, I'll take four of these and three of those, you know? They're pretty doggone happy if you can be doing that, though, you know? <laughs> well, I guess. That fri here. It frightens people when I do that, but I don't know about uh, how they yeah. come across with you. Now, uh, do you, I, I had heard that you're not, you're, uh, you know, obviously a very beautiful woman, but you're not that body conscious. You're not that hung up on being careful about what you eat and what you ingest, as well, some actually, women are. Well, actually, no, actually, I eat pretty healthy. I think that whole thing's coming from the fact that I just think that it's sad that we can't, everybody wants to, women to be one size. That's what that's I mean, about. they want women to be like, Barbie you know, like, like the incredibly, incredibly skinny, thin. Skinny, skinny, skinny. And that's what I'm against. You're against that. All right. Yeah. And there have been, there, there, there been periods of your life where you've had kids and stuff. Well, I've had and, three. Mm -hmm. And, you know, and I've been rounder. And it, I just don't like the way society makes you feel if you're, you know, when you're round. And, and I liked that whole period of my life. I felt really beautiful being pregnant mm -hmm. and nursing my children. And, mm -hmm. and I didn't, you know, I just hate the pressure women have to be under all the time. Yeah. Where do you think that comes from? Is that men saying, uh, oh, you know? It's, I think it's a combination of a lot of things. Is the it the actual Barbie were, doll itself? I think People Barbie see doll that. Is a horrible image. Uh huh. So they it, should come out with a doll of a really fat woman what? who's like a, well, a friend of Barbie's. They why should. Not? Well, they could have Barbie dolls. Barbie's all fat different. friend, you know. Why can they have Barbie dolls all different shapes and shines, sizes? Yeah. Yeah. That's not, I'm not kidding. That would be a good idea. Let's go in on this. I'm serious. I, I really do think it would be a great idea. That would be a good idea. And this was our idea. Ones. You okay. could have them with little short hair. All different say, And they could be, you know, then you give them heads. Give them brain. Mm -hmm. Let them t tell, tell us what they think. You know what I'm thinking rather now? Rather than just like this stupid looking thing with this hair that goes up, you know? <laughs> hey, and hair going a, up is not stupid. <laughs> well, hair going up is very cool. <laughs> that's right. For variety, you know. Oh, okay. All right. For variety. All right. Well, let's, let's talk just for a second about multiplicity. Yes. These films come out. It's very interesting. You it's very funny. You play opposite. Uh, I'm not giving anything away. Michael Keaton clones mm -hmm. himself because mm -hmm. he needs more time to spend with you. And there are actually four Michael Keaton. There are right? four, including the original. Mm -hmm. And there are also there are all different aspects yes, of a certain personality. Yes, and the fourth one is really great. He I was think your he was your I, favorite the one. The fourth one I think you could really relate to. <laughs> I don't, haven't seen the he's movie. The he's the that, handsomest one, I suppose, and the, the most the virile. That, now he's the one that licks his pizza and puts the pizza in his wallet. 
And and he always calls he always calls uh, Michael by the wrong name. Oh, yeah, the, he calls the idiot. Him Steve. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. He shaves his tongue. Okay, I I'm with that one. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's the one I like. He, so you were you actually that was the one you liked the most was the was the dumb one. Uh, well, he was it was very creative. Mm-hmm. Oh, good. Imagine if I was asleep, they don't show what they that, what my character does with the fourth one. Can you imagine that scene? You sleep with all four of these? I sleep, well, I sleep with all three of the clones mm -hmm. in one night. Oh, my God. This is... But I don't want to give the wrong impression. I've heard there's no nudity in this film. There's no nudity. That there's a, no nudity. And that's something that... that well... Uh, what? I, well, I've well, read interviews with you where you've said, I will not do nudity, I I'm know, against I it. I know, I know. I'm in big trouble now. Cause Why? Because the next movie I'm going to do, I'll probably be walking around butt naked the whole time. Just because <laughs> I said... <laughs> That's true. Your next movie, I heard you signed to do Naked World, actually, where you, you crash on an all-nude planet. Are you really planning to do that? You wouldn't feel self-conscious about it? I don't know. No, I don't know. I don't know. I just feel like, you know, I kind of may have set myself up for... I'm always fascinated when people can do that, because I come, you know, from the repressed <laughs> Irish Catholic uh, background, so the idea of, like, taking my tie off frightens me, let alone, I'm, you know, people that can walk around naked in front of all the technicians and everything. Yes. But yeah, I think I should make everybody take their clothes off, though, if I do it, though. Tonight? Okay. What? Well, let's all take our clothes <laughs> Everyone. off. Everyone. There you go. I tell you what, I got a good idea. We'll, uh, we'll do a quick commercial break. During that time, everyone will remove their clothes. <laughs> and we'll come back. We'll have more with Andy McDowell. So stick around. We'll see you in a second. normal kid. I'm telling you, he's our age, but he looks 40. He just ages four times faster. So I'm big for my age. And he's the biggest thing that ever hit the fifth grade. Two words. Penthouse. And four. We have liftoff. I have the penthouse. Hollywood Pictures presents Bring the basket, yeah! Robin Williams I had a scary dream. Can I sleep in here? Of course, buddy. As the kid in all of us. Jack. Rated PG-13. Starts Friday, August 2nd at a theater near you. Sears is filled to capacity with tires for whatever you drive. And right now, all Goodyear tires are on sale at the lowest prices of the season. Only at our garage. The Sears Auto Center. This is your chocolate zone. Indulge it, because now there's sweet escapes. Real Hershey's chocolate with less fat. Sweet escapes, new from Hershey. Because every kid's a magnet for germs, and every pan's a magnet for grease, there's new Dawn Antibacterial. Cuts tough grease better than any antibacterial. Kills germs on hands, too. New Dawn Antibacterial. One of the ways Ryder makes your move easier is by renting trucks with automatic transmission. Because moving doesn't have to be an uphill battle. Ryder. We're there when you need us.